select from the list, and then select, uh, hit next, and then scroll down to where it says network adapters, highlight that and click next. Then under manufacturer, we want to select Microsoft, and then network adapter, we're going to use Microsoft loopback adapter, then hit next. And then here, we're going to hit next to start installing the uh, loopback adapter. Okay, so it looks like it's finished. What we're going to do is to verify we have that loopback adapter present on our computer. I'm just going to right click on my network places, go to properties, and as you can see here that we just um, uh, we just installed the local area connection four, which is Microsoft Loopback Adapter number three. As you can see, um, I, ha I have two other ones: Microsoft Loopback Adapter one and then Microsoft Loopback Adapter number two. So, with that being said, we go back to GNS three here. You want to configure the the Cloud Zero interface for the Loopback Adapter. Now, so we just right click on the cloud and click configure. Go to uh, click on the C0. And what we want to do under the, the uh, generic Ethernet NIO, you just want to click on this. And you should see. It doesn't look like we see it yet. We're only seeing the local area connection three loop back adapter. Again, click on this. You can see right here MS loop back driver on local host local area connection three. Um, you, you, you can see here that when you when you install hardware, you're usually going to have to restart your computer. So um, we're not going to restart now. But what you would want to do now is restart your computer then you'll probably see your new loopback uh, adapter interface installed when you come back to uh, to this screen. Uh, so anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to, instead of use you know the one we just created, I'll just go ahead and disable it. And we're just going to use local area connection 3 for, uh, for this video. So again, you probably need to reboot your computer after you install the loopback adapter interface. Once you do that, come back here. You should see under the list, you should see your loopback uh, adapter installed. So just click on that once you see it and just hit add. Then what we want to do is just hit apply and OK. Now we want to go back to GNS3. We want to go fast Ethernet port. We're just going to click from the switch. We're going to we're going to click on. See, this path here is the path to the the loopback adapter three that that we have on our uh, that we just configured. Well, that that we have uh, going on here. So we're going to use uh, loopback adapter three. And another way you can look to see verify your loopback adapter is if you just go to start run and then. Uh, Type in uh, Charlie Michael Delta CMD and then hit enter. Then it'll bring you to the command prompt. What you want to do there is just do an IP config forward slash space forward slash all. And what you'll see here is your network interfaces come up. As you can see here, um, this is my connection to the internet. Via my wireless connection, and then here is my uh, loopback. So right here it says local area connection three, Microsoft loopback adapter. So this is what I'm going to be using here. Um, you can see here that DHCP is enabled, and the auto configuration is enabled. So this should be the default when we create one. You can also go under that loopback uh, adapter, just right click on it, go to properties and then go to TCP IP, select that, and go to properties, and you should see here, it should be set to obtain I an IP address automatically and DNS server automatically. So that's going to be set to use you know, dynamic host configuration protocol, or DHCP, to get the, uh, the network information that we want. You can also set it statically if you want. Okay, so back in GNS3, 
what we have now is we have our cloud zero. This is basically going to emulate um, our loopback. This is our loopback interface that we've added in the cloud zero. So this is pretty much going to emulate a connection uh, that we hand out from router one. We're going to hand out DHCP uh, network information out to our Microsoft uh, loopback adapter interface uh, that's on our <coughs> excuse me that's on our uh, that's on our workstation <coughs>